Well, great. It's a happy Naki day, and I'm, I'm excited about it. It's good for him, good for his confidence, and I hope that um, it will try and uh, uh, motivate him in the next game. The team has come under a lot of criticisms for the way they play. In the first half, I spoke to a lot of them, most of the fans are not excited. What do you make of Ghana's overall performance today? Well, um, it can be better. We can only hope that we get better. Mm. But in your, in, your, in, your, in your view, do you think that the team hasn't yet gelled under Christmas? I think that uh, we, we need to play much better than we're playing. We need to get the results. Um, in a more tidier way and um, we can only hope that the team gets better and that the coaches are able to. I like the second half response. I mean obviously it's a technical team that has seen what went on in the first half and obviously um, realized what the issues were and, and did something about it and you can see that the Ashimeru change uh, has done a lot, you know, to did a lot to how the team played and um, I'm happy about that. Again, as you being part of the executive committee, how important is it that Ghana makes it at the top of the group to get an automatic qualification to the World Cup? Well, if we say we are big boys, we need to do what big boys do. And so we have no choice than to top the group and go to the World Cup. Is it a priority that it's a must? It is. We have to. I mean, what else can be a priority? Qualification to the World Cup must be your number one priority. What else?